Today we're going to breakfast at Giada's. Giada's is on the second floor of the Cromwell. The Cromwell property used to be Barbary Coast. I can remember going to eat steak and egg breakfast at Barbary Coast 20 years ago and it was $2.99. Uh, Vegas has gone from quantity to quality. You can tell as soon as you get off the escalator. A lot of time went into everything about this place. Uh, it looks like it was designed by an artist. Everything is just seems to be done perfectly. <laughs> Thank you. I was pleasantly surprised by the fact they're not bad, not bad at all. What's on it? Um, two eggs, toast, um, spinach, bacon, meatballs, um, smashed potatoes, and crispy bologna. Crispy polenta? Is that the waffle thing? It, it just says mashed potatoes slash crispy. Hi. Uh, the original audio has a lot of ambient noise. Watch for the look on Mindy's face after we do a little bit of math and and we figure out that we are over $2,000 ahead on the first day again.
that was a really good meal. Everything was done perfectly. Um, like I said, it's hard to describe how good the food is in Vegas, but you know it's good when you go home and you have dreams about the meals that you had in Vegas. Bottom line, Giada's probably one of our top five favorite restaurants in Vegas now. If you haven't tried it yet, we highly recommend you try it. And just to make sure it wasn't a fluke, we came back the next day. The service was just as good. Everything was done perfectly again. Uh, this time we <laughs> we even tried the, the meatballs for breakfast. Uh, seemed kind of strange. Uh, probably some of that damn California influence they talked about. But hell, it's Vegas. Meatballs and martinis for breakfast, what the hell. It was awesome. Rosemary scone, it's gonna have strawberry and tomato corn, lamenta muffin, and the blueberry and cheese beans. Now, can I grab you some more coffee? 